so for part a the initial condition is just when the ball is released the final is just below square root of v square by 2g and it's just below because uh, this is the number that we get since that's what we get after taking out the maximum elevation using the kinetic model of translation motion with uniform acceleration the delta u will actually increase since air is also part of the system the work done on the the work done by the environment on the system is zero as we are considering the air a part of the system and the resistive drag of the air force is the only sort of external factor but in the question it's given that it's part air is part of the system so the network done is zero and the q is also zero since there is it's an isolated system and there is no energy transfer and the basically the energy is getting transformed from the initial kinetic energy to the gravitation potential energy and this is a reversible irreversible process otherwise it will violate the second law of therm thermodynamics for part b of the question um when uh, we're given a mixture of uh, of, of we are given two cups of water wherein one which one is cold and the other is hot and they mix together so the initial state is just the two cups just lying together and the final state will be when they reach an equilibrium temperature but in this case q net q net will be zero since the energy gained by one will be the energy lost by the other and the hotter one will lose energy the colder one will gain energy the delta u system is equal to the work done which is equal to zero since there is no interaction with the surroundings and in this case delta s is greater than zero because it's moving uh, uh, to a state of 